Hey, what's going on guys? It's Gaz here and welcome back to a brand new video. But whoa, wait a second. Before this video actually starts, we are doing a giveaway on this channel. It is for a copy of Call of Duty Black Ops Cold War. I will leave the link down in the description below if you want to enter into that competition. So, this video right here, what is going on? It is everything to do with the new zombie perks with inside of Call of Duty Black Ops Cold War. So, over the last week, two weeks, Treyarch have been leaking little bits of information. They've been teasing things like, oh, this, this is coming, this is coming, this is coming. But they've actually just released an article of a bit more information of what is exactly coming on launch. So, I'm going to just go over the actual perks at their base levels, which are going to be on launch. I won't go into their extra upgrades because that will be for a completely different video. That will be a bit more in-depth video of what is going on right there. So these perks at launch, what are they and what do they do? So this is the video that I'm going to be telling you today. So the first one on the list is Juggernog. Juggernog is making a return. It's been a couple of Call of Duty games since this perk has been around. And just like always, Jug will be increasing your maximum health by 50. So your health in the game will be at 100%. Well, let's just say your health right now after you've applied your Juggernaut perk will be 150%. So the second perk that they are putting out onto launch is the Quick Revive. This one's been around since, you know, the land before time with the bloody dinosaurs. That kind of age. It's, it's been around for such a long time. It is one of these perks that's always in the starting room. And this one actually in this game it reduced the time it takes to regen your full health by 50%. So if you've been slapped about by a zombie, basically it's going to take half the time to get yourself back up to 100% than if you didn't have this, this perk. And it also reduces the time it takes to revive your friends who've been inside the game. So if your friend is down on the floor, they need picking up, you go up to them, you pick them up, it's going to take half the time than if you didn't have this perk. The next perk inside of the launch of Call of Duty Black Ops Cold War is Speed Cola. It just increases your reload speed by 15%. There's nothing much exciting about this one, but it is now back as its own perk again. Because if you didn't know in Black Ops, uh, Black Ops 4, it was you get all four of your perks and basically they just give you Speed Cola. But in this game, they're putting it back as a launch perk. Stamina Up is making a return once again. It increases the run and the sprint speed. Nothing special about that one bit. Honestly, this is one of these perks that you need to be picking up every single game. It's like it might not sound a lot on paper, but that perk does wonders. Trust me, this is a perk you're going to be needing. Now, Deadshot Daiquiri. They're bringing this one back, and honestly, I hate this perk. And what this perk does is your aiming down sights moves to an enemy critical location and it removes scope sway. So before, it just basically aimed directly to a zombie head, but now they're saying it moves to an enemy critical location. So we don't actually know what these critical locations are. Obviously the first one's going to be the head. We don't know if there's gonna be any extras, but if there is, I will be sure to let you know. And it also does remove the scope sway. So if you, I'm, I assume if you're looking down with a sniper, it, your, your, your gun isn't just gonna like start swaying about. It's just gonna be completely removed or very very minimal and the last perk they're bringing on to the launch is a brand new perk that we haven't seen before and it's actually a perk called elemental pop and honestly this elemental pop perk what they've shown us it looks absolutely beautiful they've done absolute wonders with this one so what this perk does says every bullet has a small chance to apply a random base ammo mod effect like this is something that we haven't actually seen before this could be something like if you're gonna go on black ops 4 and you upgrade your gun a few times you get yourself i don't know like the fire or the acid or the the wind basically what it does like every let's say 10 bullets it's just going to shoot out a bit of fire and basically put a bit more damage onto the enemy instead of actually going to upgrade your guns like we did previously it's just gonna be a bit of random a bit of fun and something new which we always like to see so that is all of the base level perks that they are dropping at launch so like i said before these are base levels so obviously they're going to be upgrading and what we do know so far is once you upgraded that is a permanent upgrade 
So once you've done your upgrade, it will probably be there for your next game, which is which is pretty cool. It's awesome. It's something new. It's something that we haven't seen before. So that is something that I want to get inside of as soon as the game drops. So that is everything to do with the base level perks at launch. If you know, leave all your thoughts and your comments down in the, the in the comment section below. I'll be sure to go down there, read them all, reply back to everybody that drops a comment down there, and I hope to see you guys in the next video. So thanks for watching, guys, and I'm out. Peace.